Hi guys. First of all, don't hate the channel just because I'm a Toronto Maple Leaf fan. Uh, what I'm going to do is uh, I 3D printed all these parts. And this is the leaf. This is going to be the stem. And this is going to be the base. So I went ahead and put the face already for the Toronto Maple Leafs. I got two other ones here, which I'm going to crazy glue, and that's how it's going to look. And then I have these here, which is going to be the LEDs to illum uh, illuminate it. So I'm going to go ahead and um, crazy glue these on. I also have the green for the go and red for the leaves. And then they'll there will be LEDs in behind that to il illuminate this. So I'm going to go ahead and crazy glue this on. And I'll be right back. This is the circuit I'm going to be using for the leaf logo. show you how it actually works when it's on the logo um, I'm gonna swap except for this here the um, buck converter I'm using it right now just to test the circuit for uh, powering the um, Arduino Nano I'm gonna switch this for uh, 7804 Moffitt sorry 7805 Moffitt anyway I'll put a wire diagram for this up I'm going to cut um, some LED strips for um, the Go Leafs Go. They're going to go on here and then this will go on here. The ones I sh showed you earlier on the example on the circuit I was testing are these. But these ones here are going to be used for the Toronto Maple Leafs. I just used these to show you because I hadn't had these ones ready yet. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, cut the strips and just solder them together. They're a little bit long but I'll just bend the ends up like that. I'll put actually two sets. One here, one just below. Give it better lighting.
Okay, I have these all wired up. I'm just gonna test them, all three of them, to make sure they work before I uh, glue them on. That one works. That one works. And that one works. Yeah. Now I'll just go ahead and glue them on here. They actually have tape on the back. I'm going to be using um, 7805 here to power the Arduino. And then a uh, 12 volt su um, battery supply to power the rest. Just gonna solder these all up together. Uh, as I said, I'll put a link to the um, diagram. So this is a um, pretty tight fit in here because I'm using these uh, 3.7 volt batteries. Uh, I want to make this portable, like moving it around. I could just put a jack here, which I might end up doing it to plug it into a um, an outlet but because I, I do also want to make it portable I'm using 12 uh, 3 um, 3 3.7 volt batteries to power it and it's actually a very tight fit there's just gonna be enough room for me to put the a bottom on it but it'll work makes the base a bit heavy too so it'll keep it sturdy when it's uh, standing up
Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one.